What's going on, Cats fans? It's Ben Reeve here again from The Hoop Show for part four. Now, I shouldn't do these part one, two, three, four, because depending on what order you're watching them, it doesn't really matter. You might watch them in a totally different order. Anyway, this is my this is me doing this for the fourth time. Whatever. So this one, we're going to be looking at uh, potential captain in Mark Blitzars. Potential captain in 2023, Mark Blitzars. He's probably down the pecking order for me a little bit in terms of who I think will get the gig. Uh, I think it's probably more likely to be your Tom Stewart, your Tom Hawkins type. But I wouldn't be surprised if a Blitzarves gets the role potentially as a co-captain type arrangement. Um, we'll wait and see on that one, I suppose. Now, experience, again, five categories I'm going to go. I'm going to take a back step, step back a little bit. So five categories, experience, age, leadership, media performance, and health or health slash ill discipline now mark blitzarves experience 227 games can you believe it for the heptathlete uh 10 seasons in the comp where has the time gone feels like he was just here as a cat bay rookie only a few years ago uh 227 games he'll be nudging the 250 this year if he stays fit and healthy uh and we go reasonably deep hopefully we do in the finals uh, his age yeah he's getting on a little bit so uh in terms of ex- i'll go back in terms of experience though nine out of ten his age, a 5 out of 10. Look, he's getting a little bit older. He's 32 in March. Look, he can probably go another two or three years, and maybe that's okay. Um, you know, a 35-year-old captain, maybe, uh, in three years' time, ready to hand it over to the to a Jai Clark or someone like that, one of the other up-and-coming young fellas. I don't know. Uh, 5 out of 10, although maybe that's a bit harsh, the 5 out of 10 in terms of his age. Possibly could go a 6 or a 7 on that one, but I'll, I'm very harsh on age. I like, to be, I like him to be in that... Just gone 30 or or late 20s, mid mid to late 20s age. I've got used to Joel Selwood being the captain when he was uh, when he was quite young. So I don't know, maybe I'm a bit too harsh. His media performance, I think he's okay. He doesn't mind uh, grabbing the microphone and and walking around and interviewing players and so forth. Um, so he's not too bad. He, um, I wouldn't say I wouldn't say he's shy or anything like that. Uh, so I think he's pretty good. Uh, he speaks reasonably well. Um, no issues there. I'll give it him an eight out of ten on that one. He's not fantastic. He's not. He's not a Paddy Dangerfield, uh, but he's an eight out of ten. So I think that that's probably a fair score for him. Now his health. Uh, he's played forty eight games in the last couple of years, so that's pretty good. Uh, I've scored him a, a an eight out of ten for his health. Uh, overall, um, given him a really high score of thirty eight. Uh, so that's just to give you some comparison. Um, that's the same as Tom Hawkins. Uh, so Tom, probably in t- using this system, Tom scored the highest. Look, as I said before, I wouldn't be surprised if it's a Tom Hawkins and a Mark Blitzarves co-captaincy arrangement for next year. Uh, maybe Tom retires at season's end and, and Blitz is the uh, sole captain for the next year or two after that. Uh, he's very vocal on the field. That's probably one area I didn't mention in terms of his leadership that gives him a bit of a nod. Uh, I don't know. What do you think? Am I have I got this one totally wrong? Is there is there a swell of support for Mark Blitzarves here uh, for the captaincy role? Uh, maybe he's that kind of player that hasn't had a lot of love over the years, but now we're starting to appreciate um, what he gives to what he gives to the team and the various roles he can play and how selfless he's been. Whatever you think, let me know in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Watch these other videos that you've got up on your screen here, um, and we'll see you on the next one. Go Cats!